Hey guys, how you doing? Um, I will play a little bit of this song and then I'll, I'll teach it to you right afterwards. I'm pretty, pretty pleased. Don't you well ever feel like you're last time, last time I'm pretty, pretty pleased. Don't you well ever feel like you're done. You are done. I'm leaving out a couple of choice words there. Um, I'll do that throughout. Um, here's the chords I'm working with. Um, pretty easy. You know, I'm working out of the key of G. And um, it just goes G, D, E minor, C again and again and again. So these guys I got on the second, um, first and second string on the third fret. And they stay the whole time, pretty much. So there's my first and second string, third fret. Third fret, um, sixth string. 2nd fret, 5th string for my G. G like so. D like this, where this guy comes down to the 2nd fret, 3rd string. Shooting for it in 4. By the way, sometimes I do it like this, putting the middle finger down there on that 1st string. 2nd um, fret. So I'll go from the pinky on, pinky off. I, I really like doing that with the D. Um, but you can do it with just pinky on the whole time works just fine. Okay, so E minor is next. These guys are on the 2nd fret, 5th string and 4th string. C looks like the G, except it's just down by 1, so the G's up here. C's just down by 1. 3rd fret, 5th uh, string, 2nd fret, 4th string. That's my C. Good. That's all we need. Um, as far as the strumming goes, I'm just doing down strokes. Right at the beginning. Um, I'm just kind of like maybe one strum per per line. Wait a long time, once or twice. Um, when it gets to the mistreated place, uh, there I kind of like do strumming along with the words. So here's what that means. Mistreated, misplaced, misunderstood. The way that it's awful. Where it's kind of like hitting with. Okay, then when it gets to the chorus, then I just start doing down strokes. Pretty, pretty please, don't you ever, ever leave. And one of the tricks that I use on that is sometimes I'll hit just a couple, and then certain ones I'll accent on. I use that kind of strum a lot. It works well for, for um, rock and roll beats. And really doesn't too much matter which ones you accent. Just kind of personal preference as far as where you think it sounds good to accent. Um... Good. So now I'm going to kind of work my way through the song. I'll call out chords as I go. Um, start on G. I made a wrong turn once D twice. Dug E my way out. Blood C by bad G decisions. That's D alright. Well, E my two. My silly C G is treated, this place miss on these The way that E minor could did it so C down Miss G stayed always at D yes under F E minor Look I'm still C down G G, K, look, you're D, baby. This 
It's one of those songs that just GD, E minor, C, all the way through. It's the best chord progression in the world for making a hit song, at least, anyway. Um, so, yeah, pretty catchy song. Obviously edited it a bit, but uh, I think it gives you an idea how to play it. So, uh, thanks for watching. All right, see ya.